We're gonna go right into the match. He's playing at neutral right now. Oh, and Jab getting beaten out by Sonic's Jab. Scorch with some very good spacing so far here. It's, it's fairly even so far, too. Oh, that cart just it allows him to go in. He can jump out of it at any time, throw yeah. out any aerial. Do One of the good things, though, is that Scorch is coming in at a great angle. Um, if you end up hitting Bowser Jr. in the upper half of uh, his hurt box, you're hitting the actual Bowser Jr. So um, it does a little bit more damage, a little bit more knockback. There are points where, there are a lot of points where uh, Bowser Jr. does have super armor though, and to be caught out as Sonic, you could die pretty early if you end up getting hit with a strong punish. That was a very, very good combo by Scourge, getting a good 23% off of that combo. Oh, that up oh, yeah, he ran and into he, it. Scourge is so <laughs> notorious for landing these smash attacks that he just sits there and charges. His enemies will just run right into them. I, I don't understand why he ended up running into that. Now now the pressure's on him. You can hear the cheering in the background. Scorch just looks like he knows exactly how this character works and where to attack and when to approach. It seems to be working oh. out pretty well, but Annie ends up getting that really solid fair. Doesn't quite kill, though. If he wasn't on the other side of the stage, that might have killed him. This maybe. Oh, oh! If that uh, if that spring managed to hit him, that yeah, would have killed him. Lights out. Able to make it back. Scorch just sitting in his shield and punishing accordingly. Very, very smart play. This is what happens when, uh, honestly, you're a person who studies the characters of this game and actually plays with all of these characters. Scorch knows where the weaknesses are! Oh and once again, Another Andy drunk. runs into a forward <laughs> smash. That's one of the problems with oh. Bowser Jr. is that when you oh commit God. to a, a wow. cart action, you don't have any other option. Like, he just fell right into it. He, he could have at least jumped, but when he carts that close, there is nothing he could do. Yeah. Maybe a jump, like air dodge, but besides that, he just ran right into both of those smash attacks. Such a those dogs. quick game right there. Scorch ended up oh, taking it with ease. Andy said he had some technology to show us uh, in this particular matchup. Hopefully it comes through because Andy, I mean, he has a lot of potential mm -hmm. in this region. He's taken out some big names recently, yes. but uh, Scorch, Scorch knows a lot about this game, and it's going to be very hard oh, yeah. to come through and uh, beat someone who has so much knowledge about this. He's he's not even using the uh, the hammer, the special hammer, and I mean, that's what's really throwing me off is that he's just playing vanilla Sonic and just absolutely wrecking him. Scorch has studied so much about this game. He's one of those people who he he can use customs if he wants to use customs. He can incorporate them properly, and he can play this game vanilla and get the same results. Okay, so this is oh, exactly this is, it. this is what Andy was talking about to me earlier. Is um, hello. Andy wants to use that custom up B <laughs> uh, to cover all of Sonic's options since Sonic doesn't have any strong disjoints. Oh man. This, he said it's kind of like a Mennonite tornado. And this, uh, he just spins everywhere. You could even ledge cancel it so that right. uh, we, the trainer's lagless with that, uh, that up B of hers. And Scorch, I mean, honestly, Scorch doesn't have too, too tough of a time with it. I think that the problem with uh, using Wii Fit Trainer as Andy um, is that it's not a character that he's practiced with. He really, Andy just knows that that one particular move works, but if it stops working, Scorch is going to take out the take the stocks rather quickly. It, it looks like Scorch, and it looks like Scorch if he just stays grounded that entire time, that up beat doesn't doesn't hit as consistently as I thought it would. I mean, you should shield it and then just roll away from it because exactly. it moves very slowly. Yep, like that. Yeah, Andy. Andy, although he uh, he's been using that up beat, it's been working out for him a little bit. Oh, oh that's a spike. solid back air. No tech spike. Roll. No tech boys, none here whatsoever. Using a character that he's not completely familiar with is not working out in his favor right now. <laughs> Whoa, and it's that not doing as really much low. shield damage uh, as you know he may have thought when going into this matchup. And that Wii Fit Trainer has a lot of lag after the uh, the up B, so I don't understand why he just doesn't go for a straight punish afterwards. He, he seems a little confused on what to do, but oh, oh, that forward smash, taking it right Scorch there. Scorch has been saying um, 
during this match. How do I beat this? Just kind of yelling it out loud, but it seems like he's not really having too much of an issue with it. He's finding Wii Fit Trainer when she lands, punishes her for that really long in lag. She, he knows what to do. He's keeping up with percent rather easily as well. Yeah, we could, like all the moves that he's throwing out just have so much lag after them. But I mean, if you get hit by one of those, yeah, right there, she has so much lag after landing after that up B. It just says punish me, please. There are two spots uh, where we fit trainer is weak during that up B, and that's uh, by her feet and above her. You can still hit her in the head. It's just you have to be very, very precise with your movement. That makes sense. The hitboxes are sticking out of her, as you guys can see right there. Scorch isn't actually having a problem with the up B. As we see, he's having a problem with getting some follow-ups whenever he gets the opportunity to punish. Ooh, let's see what he could do. There we go. He's using that spring. Just tacking on a little bit of damage, but he manages to get a uh, manages to chase her down. Scorch just hoping that his opponent runs into that that uh, forward spin. It's happened twice already, so I would not be surprised. Looks like he's just looking to build up a little bit more damage for going for that forward smash. He knows he could have gotten one right then and there. It's actually a very, very close match considering, but ooh, that forward smash sends Andy in the wrong direction. Almost got it. Oh, oh. but that spring and that non-horizontal. That's one of the big weaknesses recovery. of that up B is it has very strong horizontal but no vertical. vertical. 